could talk about why there are white knights if if because isn't this a non-profit sure. show? Yes. yes. We oh, can, we can talk about your Let's sponsor. We around. have a non-profit sponsor named New Sun Rising. Yes. And they are supporting creative grassroots projects in Pittsburgh. Yeah, we have a few of those listed on our program. Yeah. We They're always on the back cover. We always give New Sun the back cover because we owe them so much. Oh and, yes. Uh, it's the only other thing that's going to be in color in our program. So because mm. we, we don't want to, we really don't want to have people fighting over. You know, purchasing the color ad or whatever. We, yeah. we just take that out and give it to New Sun because they deserve it. Um, explain your, your connection with New Sun. Um, well, turns out to run a show involving 7,000 people, you <laughs> have to have money. Um, <laughs> so we started looking into grants and um, we started researching things like the Sprout Fund mm -hmm. and Heinz, and uh, a lot of organizations will not allow you to. Uh, apply. apply for grants without having either a nonprofit sponsor or being a nonprofit yourselves. And um, we started, well, we applied for Sprout Fund first, and yeah. we actually did not need a sponsor for that, but it would be a lot easier if you had a sponsor because a lot of the paperwork is very confusing if you don't run your own organization, and mm -hmm. there's taxes and scary big words that people who are running the first opera don't know much about. And, um, like taxed income on grant money. Yeah, like they will tax mm -hmm. any, yeah. So, um, but anyway, we still applied for Sprout, and we started looking into applying for um, the Heinz endowments because mm -hmm. there's a thing called the Small Arts Initiative, which would have been perfect for our show, being that we are a small arts project and it's a new thing that would support the community because we're bringing in all these Pittsburgh artists mm -hmm. and supporting film and yada yada but you have to have a nonprofit sponsor mm -hmm. so we started heavily seeking out a sponsor we had a really great one lined up unfortunately one week before the deadline to turn in the grant application they told us they did not think they could handle taking us on we we discussed the contract negotiation oh. and that we just couldn't agree yeah there was there was too many too many um what's it they called? were already sponsoring someone and they weren't actually a uh, a group set up for fiscal sponsorship. So I think the paperwork sort of like... overload would have been too much for them to take us on it as well. Um, it was bad timing being that it was like a week till the Heinz grant was due. We'd already written our application and we're ready to submit everything. And um, so basically from that moment, I Google searched like crazy. Pittsburgh, nonprofit, supporting arts, supporting, supporting town, supporting everything in Pittsburgh, 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 Pittsburgh. And I emailed like a bazillion people. We and help. one of them was New Sun Rising and they responded, I think, within 24 hours and said, this sounds great. It was almost great. immediately. It was almost immediately. And they're like, this sounds amazing. Uh, we would love to talk to you guys about this. I mean, we, we already had a website up explaining what we wanted Our to mission do. Statement. We had a mission statement about how we thought this would benefit Pittsburgh. And... Within, like, they were like, when is everything due? We'll run this by our board next week. I'm like, this is due in five days. They went, oh, okay, well, we'll email the board now. And they did. And I got another response within, like, oh, gosh. It was, like, a day or two. And, and it was, like, two days. All it was, was so it was so crazy and, and wonderfully awesome. And they were really sweet. Um, the, the One of the, I think, executive directors, Scott, was very helpful. And he worked closely with us. And he got us all the paperwork and... And then helps. our liaison, Rich. Oh, we have a liaison. used to help Rich with legal, legal matters. matters. And, he knows a lot about kind of... lawyers and things, and we had a lot of paperwork, like, you know. Yeah, well, we had, anytime you have extras and people on film and you need all the personal release, I'm allowed to show your face on film, I'm allowed to take pictures of you and put it on our website. <laughs> I am saying I won't I'm run into traffic and then say the zombie operas told me to do it. You know, things like that. So they were just, there were so many great outlets of, of things through New Sun and they were very helpful to us and we would have meetings they would offer advice and uh, we had a lot of people who donated to the show and thanks to having a nonprofit sponsor we could then give tax deductible tax receipts deductible. Yeah. and um, that helped we, a lot and going back to the grant application which we rushed for and we were like ah we actually ended up getting both the Sprout Fund grant and we got the Heinz, Heinz Endowment grant so if we hadn't had New Sun we wouldn't have gotten Heinz which was really beneficial and it helped us better handle the Sprout Fund. So, yeah, we're still working with New Sun. Um, we had a Kickstarter project for the spring, and thanks to them we were able to do Kickstarter and do tax deductible receipts. Um, we're hoping to do more of that for the fall, and New Sun's awesome.
Yes, they're amazing. It's been, and they've made it so easy to work with them. I've heard about other fiscal sponsorship groups that have mm -hmm. all sorts of paperwork that you need to do everything through them. Anytime you need to buy something or, or, or um, pay anyone or anything like that, you have to go through the fiscal sponsor. And they just said, no, we just need to see your paperwork. We, we, need... we actually, we keep very good records. And yeah. one of our, as one of our as... good friends, John, is actually an accountant, and he helps make sure that all on our side, everything looks as orderly and proper and the numbers match and then we have a meeting with new son and we go through everything and it, it shows a lot of trust mm -hmm. that that they let us keep our own books yeah. and um and i think and it gets things done quicker too yeah, like it's much we faster not have to have the we, we know when time. when we need to pressure them and they know when to ask us for things and um we just try to make yeah. it as easy for them as possible since they're doing us this mm -hmm. huge and service in the end um all the crazy tax paperwork and everything, they made it very painless at the end of last year. <laughs> Cause, whew, not a big fan of taxes.